school will be forced to shut its doors at the end of this school year. But determined to go out with a bang and not with a whimper, the current faculty deciding to hold one final homecoming this weekend, giving alumni one last chance to say goodbye. Global Sean Knox was on hand and brings us this story. That's our principal there. She was awful nice. The teachers and all the friendships that I've made and all the sports that I had done throughout the years and winning trophies and the plaques and representing Robert Usher. Just spending time with friends and that. Just hanging out, basically. My brother's in grade 12 right now at Usher, so I think just the whole closing is really hard for our family. Robert Usher Collegian opened its doors this afternoon, providing an opportunity for alumni to take one last walkthrough of their old stomping grounds. We have over 200 people that have replied and said they're coming this afternoon, and we have lots of opportunities for them to come in and uh, see um, not only the school, but uh, see old yearbooks and pictures. After nearly 30 years of serving students in Regina, Robert Usher is slated to close at the end of the school year. And for some of their former students, it's a tough pill to swallow. Mad was one, um, heartbreaking, and um, not having a place to go back to and showing my children where I went to and being able to showcase something that I've accomplished in my life. I didn't believe it. I thought that maybe it was in the future thoughts. Um, I didn't think it would be so quick, is what I was kind of surprised about. And for some families in the city, the closure means the end of generations of tradition. In addition to myself graduating from here, all three of my children attended classes here. As I said, my youngest daughter is graduating this year, so that makes her the final grad. I was in the first class, she's in the last one. The principal of Robert Usher thought the idea of bringing in old classes was fantastic. It's a great way to celebrate who we are. Former students couldn't agree with her more. It's a, it's a good thing that somebody thought to do this anyway, so gives a little bit of closure to those of us that, that have a type at school. Sean Knox, Global News.